Black history is America's history. For America was built on the sweat, blood, and tears of our people. On the shoulders of our great people we stand. Slavery was that cross they had to bear. Black men separated from their women and children. Black women used and abused. Black on black hatred. Dark skin against light skin. As a race, some say we were cursed. But yet, out of the ashes we rose. We rose as a generation of greats. Great creators. Great inventors. Great pilots. Great teachers. Great attorneys. Great actors, great actresses, and great singers. A great people who set the tone for fashion, dance, music, and more. We are an amazing and phenomenal people. We rose despite the odds. We dealt with police brutality back then, and we deal with it now. The threat of our sons, husbands, brothers, uncles, cousins being pulled over by law enforcement for no reason or even not making it home at all. The necessity to educate them on what not to say or what not to do when pulled over. Mm. Are we an endangered species? Or will it be like days of old where we rise in spite of our situations and circumstances and dare to defeat the odds? I'm just a woman who loves God with all her heart. An author, a speaker, a podcaster, and a designer in her own right who was inspired on February the 1st, 2023 at 3.45 a.m. Eastern Standard Time to pen these thoughts. I have a voice. We have a voice. And it is imperative this month and every month that our voice matters. I end as I began. Black history is America's history. God bless you. Peace out later. Until next time, this has been Dr. Carmarill, drcarmarill.com. Shalom.